because I think it, in a way, the book and my whole my whole discussion of empathy is based primarily on this notion that when we know the when we know something, when we know the world, we can adopt two different perspectives. We can adopt our own perspective, where we look at the world in a way from out from the outside, uh, where we're responding to what we experience of other people from our own perspective. And that's what we do a lot of the time and in a lot of history is, is based on looking at the world from one's own perspective. One doesn't necessarily always need to know what the people of the past were experiencing. Um, but if we are interested in knowing what the people of the past experienced, we need to then adopt this other perspective. We need to leave our own position of, of observation and adopt the, the, the observational position of the people of the past. That's a very, very different position. And as I've tried to suggest in our conversation, uh, uh, allows us to, uh, to write a different kind of history, to tell a different story than the story that we write when we look at the people of the past from our own autonomous position. So since um, the position that we adopt determines in a way what kind of history we write and that the two positions yield two very different histories. I think it's very, very important that historians be aware of when they are empathizing and when they are not. And I think one of the problems with history as it is today is that historians often use empathy, but they don't know that they're doing it. They kind of go back and forth between their own position and the position of the people of the past in a kind of unselfconscious way. And I think that's problematic given the fact that, as I mentioned now several times, that the, the, the two different observational positions yield two different histories. And so just, just as we need to be clear about what we mean by the, by the concept empathy, I think we need to do our very best to be clear about which observational position we are occupying at any given moment. And that's really hard to do.